Hello, teacher. Hello, Lin. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? I'm good. Okay, what's the weather in Vietnam? Uh, a little bit. It's a little bit cold. Little bit cold. Okay, in my country, yeah. there's still, again, we have LPE. It means LPA. It means uh, it's low pressure area. So there is a tendency that storm is coming. So maybe tomorrow. Oh, so sad. That's why we don't have class today and tomorrow. Okay. What a waste. Now we are already in unit 4C elementary solution. Okay, Lynn? Okay. Okay. So, okay, so we have here different meaning, Lynn. We have the word. Throw away. Throw away. Okay. Next. Fresh. Fresh. Usually a uh, food recently produced or okay. Next we have the Freegan. Freegan. The person who only eats food that he can get for free. Okay, they are freegan. Okay. So from the word free, they will only eat food for free. Next recycle. Recycle. Treat uh things that have already been used so that it can be used again so that we call it as recycle reuse okay next next you reuse to use something again okay next is disgusting it extremely unpleasant next collect to bring Things together from different people or places. Next, environment, the natural world in which people, animals, and plants live. We call it as natural world. Okay, the environment, like the forests. Okay, what we can see, all the trees. Okay, they are the environment. Okay, by the way, Lynn, you can see my picture. Okay, the Zoom video isn't working for me right now because maybe because the weather is not good too. Okay, so you can see, just don't be bothered with my, at my picture. I'm not moving anymore. Okay, there is something wrong with my video. Okay, so another one, look at this. Lynn, describe the photo. Look at this, what you can see in the photo. You use words hello to help you. Okay, can you describe the photo using the words here? Okay, you have seen here words. You use that to describe the picture. Okay, you can write in the chat box or you can write here. Okay, Lynn? Go, Lynn. I will wait you.
Okay, now. Yes. Throw away egg, fruit, vegetables, old in the rubbish bin. Okay, very good. This is what we call rubbish bin. So rubbish, it means garbage. Okay, very good. Okay. So we have here, uh, Lynn, we usually stress. What is unstressed words? We usually stress the important content of the words. Important. So it means important. Example, nouns, names, main verbs, adjective, questions, and words. Okay. So I will erase first. Okay. So this is Tom is in the kitchen. So the one underlined here, this one and this one, they are the stressed words. So they are important. Tom is the name of person. Kitchen is the name of place where you cook. Okay, where is the knife? So where and knife, they are the stressed words or the content words, important content words. Okay, if there is no knife, you cannot understand where is the oh, what where is the okay tom is in the where is tom so the one underline they are called lean as important content words okay lynn okay next one lynn less important it means not so important what do you call the word which is not so important okay we called it as functional words okay less important functional words are often unstressed means not stressed it's prepositions model verbs articles conjunctions the verb be pronouns possessive adjective okay so we call it as what they call that functional words or the unstressed words okay so we have here the vowel sound in an un unstressed word sometimes changes to hua, hua. it's from hua, hua. okay from it's this is you read this one okay you read this as from but this one, it becomes the tua sound. It's from, from. Okay. So another one. Okay, now, Lynn, look at this. The Freakonism. Again, a while ago, teacher talked about the Freakonism. Okay, so Freakon. It means the person who always eats free. Food. Okay, you choose, okay, to complete the context about freeganism, please try to, okay, look at this one, try to, okay, check this one, okay, you choose the correct answer.
Okay, great job. Go. Finish teacher. Okay, come on, Tem. How's your Tem? It's quite. It's quite okay. Quite quite okay. The Tem. Yeah, tungo anan. Okay, so in the UK, we threw away seven million tons of. What's the answer, teacher? Food and drink every there's a food, there's a drink. Uh lean. So of course there's a food. Supermarkets throw away food that is past its sale date. So it means it is already expired. Okay, example the the, the manufacture date is December 22, and then you found out it's already okay. Now is already January 4. I know January 11. So it means it sell by date. It means it's already expired. Okay. And they also throw away what? Fruit and vegetables that are the raw okay, shape or size. Oh, in the Philippines, we did not do that. Okay. The, the department stores try to sell it even though it is out of shape. Okay. Next is. Next is we have. We also waste a lot of food at home because we buy too much or cook too much for a meal. And 35% of school lunches go straight. Okay. Into the rubbish bin or the bin okay free guns are very what angry about this of course if they are free gun you will be get mad because some of the food that's supposed to be given to them you will gonna put it in the trash bin so it's quite bad you try okay Okay, and so they get angry, Lynn, because free guns are the one who receive free food. But other people, okay, they try to put all their lunches right straight in the rubbish bin. Free guns are very angry about angry. this. Yeah, they're very angry. They try not to waste anything. But people, even in your school, maybe. Okay, other children, if they will not eat the biscuits or the bread, they will put it in the rubbish. If the freegan can see that, the freegan will get angry. Because 
they try not to waste anything then they collect good food at supermarkets threw away and they eat it give it to people who are hungry very good frequent recycle and reuse other things too wow so if they can see that those things or the food can be eaten lean they will gonna recycle and reuse it recycle it means cycle again maybe they will cook again or use reuse they will use it again okay for example clothes and furniture okay if they can see clothes being thrown everywhere they will get it clean and they will gonna use it again they want to change the way we live so that's vegans they hate and they get angry to people who keep on throwing things even though that things can be useful okay so that is the main idea about veganism okay you have to keep things okay now very good now listen and underline the content words content it means important words okay please underline the content words okay lean please listen teacher will just go to the bathroom okay, okay. please listen carefully and underline the content words Training again here, Lynn. I will just close the window. Okay, listen. Lesson 4C. Exercise 3. 1. Where's the bread? 2. Can you pass me the salt? 3. Dan is in the cafe. 4. His sister Sophie can cook. 5. What's the name of this song? 6. Sushi is from Japan.
basket? Okay, let us check one again. Lesson 4C. Exercise 3. 1. Where's the bread? 2. Can you pass me the salt? 3. Dan is in the cafe. 4. His sister Sophie can cook. 5. What's the name of this song? 6. Sushi is from Japan. Okay, so let us check. Lynn? Okay, where's and bread? Correctly. Next, can you pass me the salt? Okay, very good. Pass and salt. Next, Dan is in the cafe. Sister Sophie and Cook. What's the name of this song? Sushi. Japan, yeah. So you understand that words considered as content words. Okay, we have Okay, so here. Now you listen. How are the italicized and stressed words pronounced? Okay. Sorry, Lynn. Lesson 4C. Example. Exercise 4. From. 1. Pizzas from Italy. 2. Here are two apples. Three. Where's your cup? Four. I can help you. Five. I'm going to the cafe. Six. Salt and pepper. Seven. Here's some cheese. Eight. This apple is for you. Teacher, can you give me one example? Okay. Lesson 4C. Exercise 4. 1. Pizzas from Italy. 2. Here are two apples. 3. Where's your cup? 4. I can help you. 5. I'm going to the cafe. 6. Salt and pepper. 7. Here's some cheese. 8. This apple is for you. Okay, look at this, Lynn. From it's the two words. Okay, two. Okay, find it hard. Okay, sorry for this one. So I know this is quite hard for you because we did not study this. This is in speech lesson. Okay, let's move in. Now, you listen then to the interview with the free gun. Oh, you know who is a free gun? Only one of this sentence is correct. Which do you think is correct? Okay, we have three sentences. But as what teacher Anne said, there is only one. This sentence is correct. Lesson 4C. Exercises 5 and 7. Adam, you are a freegan from London in the UK. So, what is a freegan exactly? Freegans eat food that other people throw away. 
and they sometimes give the food to other people. Why do you do that? Well, I believe that rich countries throw away too much food, and they throw away good food. It's bad for the environment. I see. So, what exactly do you do? We collect food from supermarkets and restaurants. It's food that the supermarkets and restaurants throw away. Do you find the food in rubbish bins? Isn't it disgusting? <laughs> no, we don't find it in rubbish bins. Supermarkets usually put food in bags and leave them outside. The food is fresh and unopened. Supermarkets order too much food, and they throw away the extra food. It isn't old food; it's good food. There's nothing wrong with it. Oh, it's a terrible waste. And how often do you collect food? Once or twice a week. I usually find a lot of food. I take it, and I sometimes give it to homeless people, and I still have enough food for me. When do you collect the food? What time of day? We can't do it while the shops and restaurants are open, so we have to collect the food at night. Are you a freegan because you don't want to spend money, and because you want free food? No, not at all. I'm a freegan because I want to make the environment better.、Okay. When people waste food, they waste money and they waste time and resources. Okay, so they said that if you waste food, you are wasting money and you are wasting resources. So that's what they told you. There are three sentences here, but there is only one correct. Okay, okay, yeah. Adam gives food to the homeless people, the people who doesn't have or who don't have houses. Okay. Now you listen, Lean, and please complete the sentences. How many unstressed words are there in each box? Okay. Example. Okay, this is the example. Lesson four C, exercise six. One. Adam is a freegan from Luton in the UK. Two. He collects food from supermarkets and restaurants. Three. He collects the food three or four times a week. Four. He has to collect the food when it's dark. Five. A lot of Adam's friends are freegans. Six. They never come to his house for a meal. Okay, sure. Lesson four C, exercise six, one. Adam is a freegan from Luton in the UK. Two. He collects food from supermarkets and restaurants. Three. He collects the food three or four times a week. Four. He has to collect the food when it's dark. Five. A lot of Adam's friends are freegans. Six. They never come to his house for a meal. Teacher, can I listen? Yes. Again, again. Okay, okay. 
Sorry, Lin, ha? Because look at my video. It's not really good. I'm, I, can, uh, I, I can move. It's freezing. Okay, please listen. It's okay. Lesson 4C. Exercise 6. 1. Adam is a freegan from Luton in the UK. 2. He collects food from supermarkets and restaurants. 3. He collects the food three or four times a week. 4. He has to collect the food when it's dark. 5. A lot of Adam's friends are freegans. 6. They never come to his house for a meal. Okay. Yes, I'm finished. Okay, let's have here. He collects food from supermarkets and restaurants. Very good. He capital letter collects the food three or four times a week. Very good. He has to collect the food when it's dark. Very good. A lot of Adam's friends are freegans. Okay, they come to his house for a meal. Okay, very good, Lynn. Yay! So, you have the really good listening skills. Okay, let us continue Unit 4C. Unit 4C on Sunday morning. Okay, Lynn? Lynn, okay. are you with me? Yeah. The weather here in my country, Lynn, is not really good. It's raining outside, Lynn. It's not really good, Lynn. It's raining outside. Oh. Yes. It is, it is warm and cold. How about there? In here, it's raining outside. That's why, Lynn, we don't have class. Uh, this afternoon and tomorrow whole day, Schools here, all the schools in, in my province are all suspended. So we don't have class. Children will not go to school. Teachers will not go to school. Okay? For now, teacher Anne will say goodbye. Okay? Thank you, Lynn. Goodbye, teacher. Good night. Good night.